Armstrong from Charles Vaccination. And apparently there's still a mass panic going on. The grocery store I'm in right now, I won't name it, but are we serious people? Are you that serious? Are you serious? Like, the freeze, the refrigerator section for the meat is just about empty. I'm not kidding you. This is some stuck on stupid thing. The y'all gotta stop. Okay, because now the food's starting to run out. And I have to make choices here. I found that something went up in price. Up, not down. The whole um, but actually went up in price, so that saddens me to the point where low-income people like myself, how am I supposed to live if everything went up in price? You know what I mean? Like, look, some of this is supposed to be $2.99, they put it for $3.99, $4.99. Okay, if you're trying to get it off your shelf, what are you doing? What are you seriously doing? I'll get a couple of small bags of these potatoes. But to know that people will go as far as clearing out the meat, they'll go as far as clearing out most of the frozen veg. I mean, this is like this is seriously insane, people. This is seriously... I'm trying not to get the fella behind me. Um, this is insane. Total insanity. So, I'm not going to keep this on for too long. Because I'm in the store. They don't know I'm recording. They probably will after they see my lips moving. And I keep looking at the camera. But I have to say that I'm appalled at, like, people are still buying toilet paper out there. Um, and you're only supposed to be limited to one. And, uh, so let's find that, that aisle, right? Paper products. Like, and I'm appalled at the price on this, right? The $20.99 for paper towel. Like, no. What did they do? Excuse me. Sir. So, like, oh, paper product. Where is it? Where is it? That's what I want to know. We're lucky to still have some huge cheap case at home, but are you serious? Are you that serious about your butt? Like, all that's really left here is nose blowers. Serious. Everybody out there that's doing this and this hits everybody's YouTube channels, y'all gotta stop. Y'all really have got to stop. Only thing that's left on the shelves is just paper towels. Um, oh, and I did need some batteries for something. But I'm appalled at the price of a very small pack of battery. Like, this is nuts. Driving the economy prices up doesn't help. It just doesn't help. Like, I know batteries were supposed to be on sale. I needed some anyway. But the prices. Oh. Those of you out there actually grabbing a bunch of stuff because you feel like, oh my god, it's the zombie apocalypse. Knock it off. Do you think it's the zombie apocalypse? Why aren't you grabbing dried and canned goods instead of refrigerated goods. 
And that's just a darn good question. Like, serious? And I'm telling you all the truth. Now, the only thing that I can say that I have a lactose intolerant to, that's not at a bad price, okay? But I'll leave you out there doing this. Got to clear the shelves today. Like, what the freak of bejeebus are you doing? Don't give mouse panic. There's no reason. It's a flu virus. The flu. I put this in my videos yesterday. It is a strand of the flu. Look on your Clorox wipes. Look on your uh, Lysol wipes. It says on the Clorox and the Lysol wipes that it's been combating the human corona A2 I should say the human corona influenza A2 virus for a very long time we are only on strand of that number 19 which means there's 12 strands that weren't either dismissed out in, or put into the public or they did and everybody survived and they didn't want you to know it now they're calling it a pandemic when in fact it's not actually a pandemic it's making everybody freak for no reason so like y'all left no like where's the bread where's the bread people that that's gone Oh my gosh, like, I see the coffee creamer that my friend and I drank, and I'm literally going to go grab the last one of it, because screw this, you're not taking my coffee creamer away from me, like, the coffee creamer's almost gone because of this crap, look at this, where the freak are the eggs? Because people are panicking over what? The flu. It's the flu. The fake news out there has you guys panicking over the flu. And as someone that was supposed to be a reporter, I'm going to tell you straight out the door. Excuse me, sir. Stop panicking. They're trying to lock down the world economy is what they're trying to do is lock down the world economy. Um, meat prices, I can say some of these meat prices aren't too bad, okay? But who is going to pay $8.99 for a packet of bacon? Yeah, I can put it back on me, there was an employee. Anyway, who's going to pay $8.99 for a packet of bacon? I know one thing for sure. I'm not. I'm looking for popcorn seed. Now, see, I'm actually looking for popcorn seed. Now, the stuff that goes into the microwave, a lot of people are like, oh, my gosh, they're going to shut off the power. No. You guys are not paying attention. No. Like, the crap that we shouldn't be putting in our bodies, like the junk food, that's what's left on the shelves, is the junk food. This doesn't look like that wine. I don't have a license for that. Anyway, I just want to let you guys know. Stop. Just stop. It doesn't help anybody. See, I can't find any popcorn seed. I wanted popcorn seed. But we're not going to find that now, are we? Why? Because a lot of y'all went freaking nuts. And I'm serious about the toilet paper and the water. I am seriously serious. Oh, look, they did get some water back in stock. Now, that's a given. You know what? You're limited to one. And I saw somebody put two cases in their cart. And you're literally.
limited to one. One. So let's say I, I want to get a case of water, all right? Hold on. Let me actually attempt to put this in my cart. Okay. So, um, like I said, you know, I just read that fine, one, 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 one. People are just packing this in their cart. I have to go past the cash register, so hold on. And it's like people don't even know how to shop right now. And it's not. So I'm going to see about grabbing some Asian noodles because I can cook anything with those. Hold on. So like everybody else is having an issue finding rice and beans. Well, <laughs> some people are picky about the beans that they eat. I'm not really a picky eater when it comes down to beans. Now they do have some tuna shell, tuna on the shelf which isn't on a bad price point, but again, it's packets of tuna. And, um, so we'll finish up when I'm done in here. But here's what I'm talking about. If y'all are worried about the flu, why aren't you buying soup? Serious. Why are you worried about everything else, but you're not worried about eating soup? I mean, you can't eat toilet paper. So, I kind of noticed that I'm being followed around by a store employee. But, I think that's because I don't really want you to know in this little dinky town. It's the same issue as everybody else. So, I'm trying to keep on the low with this, but I'm talking into my phone. As far as I know, I can be video calling with someone. And that quite frankly wouldn't be their business. So... I guess they have plastic essentials. Like, look, if you're thinking you're in the apocalypse, go ahead and get this stuff. Why isn't that off the shelf, right? The heck is a paper straw? Plastic, uh, everybody wants to complain about straws. There's paper straws. Uh, I have to laugh about that. And they dropped the price on them to $1.99. There you go. I finally said $1.99. Um, so basically, all the cooking spray is gone. I don't have to worry about that. But I will let you know all of this is over the flu. Um... And God forbid our president gets called the Chinese flu because that's the laboratory it came from was in China. So don't call him racist. Just stop that. That's stupid. It's where it came from. Uh, oh yeah, let me show you something else. Okay, and here's the other thing I wanted to show you guys. Like, where the freak is the meat? The meat, people. You're finally starting to wipe out protein. And then people are forced to buy stuff that they don't want to buy. I don't eat hot dogs, but I got a packet of sausage. Okay, everything that I just bought is because it was an essential of a need, not a want. It's essentials of need for survival. Right now, it's kind of survival of the fittest, so... I do have to go find something for backup for coffee creamer, and I'll be back. Okay, so it looks like I won't be getting the backup coffee creamer either. People apparently thought the same thing. So they don't have any more Death Wish coffee on the shelf, in case you were looking for Death Wish coffee. They don't seem to have that on the shelf, which is, you know, fine. I'm fine with it. Oh, wait, they do. Oh, I found but am I paying $23.99 for a bag? No. So like I'm saying, now that I'm back in the car, now you guys have got to see the debauchery of nuts. Nuts. Like I was saying to a guy in line, you're only supposed to have a limit of one for a case of water. He took three. 
when the sign clearly says one. And there's still no toilet paper. Not even on the end aisles. No toilet paper. So, um, with that said, this is just going to go on my, my YouTube. Because I'll have to clip this down anyway. If I put it on my Instagram. Jeez, it's like, what's with some of these people? Like, she doesn't know how to drive. Like, okay, Wendy's is closed. Wawa's is open. Well, that, if I was if I was that one store that was told that, I would use that as the example. Yeah. That's not even. And then gas went down to two dollars and nine cents. That is not a joke. Two dollars and nine cents. That would only be good be because they cut the tax on. Yeah, they cut the tax. And think about this, people. If they're cutting the tax on the gas right now, what's the price going to be when all this is over? It's going to be exponentially crazy. You got to make it up somehow. Yeah. So, now that you've seen all this, we're almost back to the house. You don't need to know where I live. Um, so, stay happy, stay healthy, stay positive, And as always, stay blessed. And I will catch you. And there is no crisis. Remember that. That's right. <laughs> and I will catch you in the next one.